Hey guys, welcome to another video and today I'm gonna show you how to install an apex file without getting into any kind of error. So if you don't know how to download an apex file of any app or game, you just go to the description and check my previous video. So let's just get into it. So I've decided to install minecraft apex file. I got it right here and this is what I'm gonna do. First thing is to extract this file with something like 7 zip. Here we go. Let's just wait. Alright, it's done. You just go into this and find the file called apex signature.p7x. This file. This is important. You find this and you delete it. See? easy now you can just hop on to installation first thing is to open up powershell you can just search it you just search it like powershell here we go and um, yep now type this command add dash App X package or right, add dash apex package now space. Now, what you gotta do is to find this file called apex manifest.xml right here. You drag and drop that file into this, just like this. There we go. Now hit space again dash type register that's it just hit enter all right now you see there are no errors and it installed perfectly but my guess is that you got an error some sort of red as text so that mostly happens because you don't have the dependencies required by the app. If you don't know what the dependency is, they're just like external apps. You can download the apex files of those and install them just like we are doing this. So I've downloaded the dependencies for Minecraft. Here we go. If you don't know how to download the dependencies for the app, you just check my previous video link in the description so we don't have to extract these to install these are easier to install you just type add apex package now space and you just drag and drop this that's it no registering things just hit enter that's it you just install the other one just like that I'm not gonna install that because I already did and now do the same command again after installing the dependencies you can just hit enter now it's gonna work believe me actually the most common reason to those errors are just missing dependencies I've shown the way how to fix that and you remember that file I deleted in the beginning I did that because that file causes like startup crashes on some games that's why I deleted it it'll fix that so you can see minecraft is installed you can see here or right here if I open it up it's working so if you got more errors please just let me know in the comments and thanks for watching if you like this please just leave a like and hopefully do subscribe I'll just see you in the next video